Pandemonium broke out at the St. Agnes Primary School this morning following a confrontation between a teacher and the parents of a student of the school. It all began after an altercation between two classmates at the school. This was also understands that one of the students was injured after being kicked to his groin area and began passing blood. The teacher rushed the lad to the Georgetown Public Hospital where he was treated and given medical attention to stop the bleeding. According to the boy's mother, Later on that same night, she had to rush her son to a private hospital after he continued to pass blood to his penis. Eventually, when I went home, like after 11, I checked in my son because he was wearing pampers. When I checked in him, he was still bleeding. I took him from, I get up and I took him to Balloon Singh Hospital and they did, um, they operated on him. He had stitches, two, two sets of stitches and... Uh, they said to bring him back on Saturday so that they can see what's going on. He got a release. They got to take out like one set of the stitches on Saturday and then I got to see well what more they got to do with him. The woman said it was agreed on that the parents of both of the students will meet at the school this morning to deal with the matter. But things turned ugly when the other child's parents allegedly accused the teacher of inciting the injured boy's parents to deal with the matter differently. The parents reportedly assaulted the teacher and it was captured on video. Police at the Alberton Police Station were called in and arrested the parents and also invited the teacher to the station. Collis Nicholson, Regional Vice President Demerara of the Ghana Teachers Union, related to this newscast what was told to him by the teachers about the incident. Something was said and the parent got up and started abusing the teacher physically. The teacher was on the floor, the teacher clothes were torn down, um, the male parent held the teacher here. Um, slapped her in her face and all of that and so we are the Alberton police station where a confrontation was done by the police with the parent and the teacher involved and we are here to give the teacher support because this is not the first time a teacher has been injured on the job and we at the union we are saddened by this and we are going to take a very strong stance upon this because there was a similar incident at, at Winfor Garden Primary and to date, we have not heard anything from the judicial system in relation to that teacher parent being charged for assaulting that teacher. He said today's incident will not go unnoticed and his union plans to have a public outcry on the matter. The police are currently investigating the matter. 